so big, so much to do and see. I'm a young prospect of prodigy. I can't succeed in being you. So you be you and I'll be me. I'll be me. I just like you, I'm gonna be me. I just like you, I'm gonna be me. Well, hello, friends. Thank you for joining me today. My name is Kujo, and this is. It looks like we have a special message from one of our viewers. Hi, Kujo. I have a question. What's Father's Day? Thank you so much for your question. Let's try to figure this out together. Okay, friends, today we're going to find out why we need to celebrate Father's Day. But in order to help us understand what Father's Day is, we need to understand a couple of key words. One, Father's Day. Two, father. Three, role model. Four, share. Five, love. Father's Day is celebrated around the world to recognize all the great work that fathers and other father figures make into the lives of their children. This day is a celebration of male parents. It can be celebrated on a variety of dates worldwide, and many countries choose to typically celebrate this day on the third Sunday of June. Father is referred by many children as daddy, dad, papa, dada, etc. Dads have a very, very important role in raising young boys and girls. They just don't sit on the couch and watch TV. No, no, no. They take care of you when you're sick, they play games with you, they listen to your stories, and they make sure that you are protected and loved. Role model. A role model is someone who other people want to be like, either right now or sometime in the future when they grow up. Fathers share their time and their money and their life experiences, and their food, and their love. Love. Love by challenging your kids, by protecting your kids, by encouraging and accepting your kids on how they are unconditionally. That means no matter what. Let's take a look at some of our dad friends and find out why they enjoy being fathers and what they plan on doing on Father's Day. My name is Don Bruno and I'm father to Christopher, Natasha and Denzel. Being a father to me means unconditional love for my children, not expecting anything back in return but in fact getting lots lots more back from them what i enjoy about being a father is seeing my children grow into awesome loving caring adults and co contributing members of society on father's day we're going to get together in the backyard and have a barbecue and uh, lots of laughs play some games, and just have a wonderful time as a family. So for me, being a father is the ultimate blessing. It is um, hard to put into words, but you have these two little amazing beings who are their own people, but they also have a piece of you in them. And um, it's amazing to see myself and them as they continue to grow and develop. And it's amazing how much I learn from them about myself every day. And that to me is the ultimate blessing that I get from being a father, is that they teach me so much more about myself. The journey of knowledge 
of myself isn't over yet. And um, they certainly are helping me along the way. So it's quite fulfilling, uh, challenging at times, um, usually pretty fun, and I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world. Hi, Cujo. Hi, my name is Ian. Oh man, what do I love about being a dad? I believe it's one of the best things that you could ever do. Um, the idea of walking hand in hand and watching somebody over the years grow with you, nothing better. What I'm looking forward to for Father's Day is catching up with the family, catching up with my boys and my daughter and just saying, you know what? Watching them grow. I hope this all works. Yeah, stay blessed and have fun. Hi, Cujo. Hope everybody's well. My name is Myron and I'm super, super, super happy to be a father. It makes me feel so good. Uh, it makes me feel honored. I, I don't really have words that express my true feelings in being a father, but it's one of the most proudest, proudest moments in my life when um, all three of my kids were born. And to watch them become the people that they're becoming really makes me feel um, proud. So if I could give you one word today, that word would be proud. I'm proud to be a father. Um, let's see, what, are the, what do I enjoy the most about being a father? Um, I enjoy watching my kids have a great time, smile, laugh, play, and just be kids. And uh, makes me appreciate when I was a kid one day, and uh, <laughs> way back before. But uh, now being a, 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 an older adult father, man, and, and watching my kids just makes me really wanna make sure I'm there for them at all times and to protect them and provide love and security and safety for them. Um, to be honest, for Father's Day, all we're gonna do is have a good time. We're gonna have a nice barbecue, we're gonna have some music playing, we're gonna play, we're gonna run, we're gonna laugh, and just appreciate family. One of the most important things in this world is family, and I think more and more now than ever before, people are learning to appreciate that. So I wanna wish you guys the best Father's Day ever, and I hope and pray that uh, you guys take care of your father, or, or just take care of the person that represents the father to you and um, be safe, be well, and uh, hope to see you on the next episode. Take care, bye. The best thing about being a father is waking up with your kids, going to do their activities, you know, learning from them every day. What I enjoy about being a father is simply spending time teaching them, them teaching me at the same time, and I mean, just the, the everyday runarounds and seeing them uh, uh, gradually learning more, doing more, and becoming little humans, little versions of yourself. Uh, what, what I'll be doing for Father's Day, I'll probably be going for a picnic with my three daughters, ages 20, 15, and 7. And uh, that'll probably be it. Hi Cujo. Hi Cujo. This is Malcolm and Quincy here. How old are you, Quincy? Three. Three. Yeah. And um, well, being a father is great because it's about you know using the teachings of our elders and and making a new generation that's gonna be even better, more understanding and accepting, and you know where all lives matter, black including included. So um, on this uh, Sunday for Father's Day, we're gonna have a big picnic. You wanna have a big picnic? Mm -hmm. Yeah, who's the best daddy in the world? Daddy. Yeah, it's daddy. Have a good one, Kujo. Bye bye. <laughs> hey, Kujo. Happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. I've been a dad for five years now, and one of my favorite things to do with my kid is to read his favorite book, My First Best Friend. It's a really nice book about a father and the relationship he has with his kid. I suggest all fathers read it. Bye! Happy Father's Day! Hey Cujo! Hey Kwaku, how are you? <laughs> oh, thank you. I I'm well. Uh, I was wondering, mm -hmm. could you read me a story about fathers? Absolutely I can read you a story about fathers. Okay, I was thinking maybe we can read a story together called 
How I Love You, Daddy by Anna Pinatero. Sounds perfect. Excellent. Let's read it together. Under the Milky Way, three little tigers were tumbling with Daddy. Aww. Three little tigers blew raspberries and said, This is how I love you, Daddy. <laughs> Little polar bear was chasing daddy over the snow. Oh. Little polar bear nipped at daddy's neck and said, this is how I love you. <laughs> Baby hedgehog was rolling in the shrub. Baby hedgehog bounced on daddy's tummy and said, this is how I love you, Daddy. Aww. Little elephant was playing in the river. Little elephant splashed Daddy and said, This is how I love you, Daddy. In the emerald leaves, little panda was hiding. Little red panda pounced on Daddy's shoulders and said, Oh, this is how I love you, Daddy. That's right. <laughs> Little wild hair was jumping higher than daddy's ears. Whoa. Little wild hair nestled and wrestled with daddy and said, This is how I love you, daddy. That's right. Baby blue penguin was sloshing in a pool. Baby blue penguin dived onto daddy and said, This is how I love you, daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Little barn owl was flying to the moon and little barn owl swooped high and low over daddy and said, This is how I love you, daddy. That's right. <laughs> Under the Milky Way, it was time for the three little tigers to go to bed. <sighs> daddy nipped, bounced, splashed, pounced, Wrestled, dived, swooped, and blew raspberries on his three little tigers. And that is how I loved you, he said. The end. <laughs> that was a good story, Cujo. Well, thank you. I'm glad you liked it. Maybe we should say a special Happy Father's Day to everybody that's watching. Okay. Happy Father's Day, everybody. Happy Father's Day, everybody. Special thank you going to Kwaku for a wonderful question on why we need to celebrate Father's Day and fathers in general. Thank you for your question. And a special shout out going to Shelf Life Bookstore based here in Calgary, Alberta. Thank you for allowing us to use your bookstore in order to read books for our little children and our fans all around the world. So thank you so much. If you have a question that you want to go ahead and ask me, please shoot a video stating your name, your age, your location. And of course, don't forget to ask your question. Your parents can join in on the fun as well. Send your video at the email address below and we'll do our best to answer all of your curious questions. It's time for me to go, but I'm looking forward to seeing you all really soon. Remember to be kind, be brave, and to be curious. But most importantly, is to be yourself. If you like our videos, please click on the subscribe button. And don't forget to follow us on YouTube, on Twitter, on Instagram, and on Facebook. For more information about our show, please visit us at kujoskidzone.com. Bye for now.
much to do and see. Let's go see. I'm a young prospect of prodigy. A prodigy, a prodigy. I can't succeed in being you. So what you do? So you be you and I'll be me. I'll be me. I just like you, I'm gonna be me. Cool job, cool job. Just like you, I'm gonna be me. Cool job. 